Welcome back to School of Civil Engineering. This is Heather Tulap with another new video. In a previous video, I have shown you that how we will find out detailing or schedule of columns for a building. Now, in this video, I am just going to show you that how we will find out our beam schedule. So, just if you select in 3D, okay, if you select in 3D and if you come here, draw, then you will see that there have no beam schedule here okay they have no beam schedule here so uh, if you want to get your beam schedule in that way just you have to click here management so from here um, select putting reaction so from here I select what you want okay drawing I mean for who is drawing you want to get concrete beam detail just click here concrete beam detail and click here add uh, detail not generated yet so just click here generated this is the uh, not generated yet not generated not generated yet ok just remove wall and after that cancel just uh, come here for our uh, that floor ok then just click here drawing management Sorry, just come here. Schedule management. Okay, so column beam, column uh, concrete beam schedule from here. Concrete beam schedule, then click add. Uh, okay, so uh, after that, actually, that's not mandatory to do it just uh, remove that then ok now for um, suppose you need detailing for that floor just uh, come to that floor here and click here beam schedule ok and from here select your a scale I will just select and they have many suitable a scale here 1 inch 13 so just I will uh, select a scale one inch um, that is the good one is in equal to uh, one feet okay then minimum text block spacing you can also give it here and after that uh, if everything is okay from here then press okay okay after that uh, a autocad fight will be opened and we'll find out our data here just see that from here just see that uh, just see here that uh, actually this is for number beam 1 this is beam width and beam depth then the bottom bar here is the bottom bar ok uh, number 2 bar in bottom 2 bar ok 2 bar number 4 2 bar in bottom okay and for top left side number two here uh, this is the center number two four and left number two four okay so it's uh, left has the distance 25 percent of total distance so and here is for history up okay here is for history up and uh, for that uh, is still up just see here uh, our value is uh, number 3 bar and its distance is, distance is 5 inch 29 to 32 okay that is our, our distance and after that uh, this is the fastest span internal span in the span fastest span internal uh, internal spans you can see here everything okay so this is uh, the reinforcement detailing for our full second story i mean uh, first story okay now just uh, suppose that you need for a specific beam detailing so just uh, go to our software from here just uh, suppose you need beam detailing for that beam just select that beam then right click okay after right clicking uh, give here 
uh, so from here uh, after right click sorry uh, first of all you have to go in 3 and just move that and for which uh, line of beam you want to get your detailing just uh, for that line select and then right click after that generate detailing drawing okay generate detailing drawing then just uh, select your scale here after that press okay and now see that here is your detailing with respect to here your detailing with your data I mean um, with your detailing I mean with your figure here also um, and uh, also just you can see that sorry for here uh, here is a column section also and uh, for here um, this is our beam and just if you see here from that point to that point okay from that point to that point here that point to that point I mean uh, 7 inch from center point 7 inch from uh, center point of our uh, I mean seven, uh, 7 inch from center point of our beam line so from here uh, it's e strap will be number 3 strap and it will be 20 total 25 strap okay so and uh, its distance will be 10 inch 10 inch okay its, uh, its distance will be I mean strap one strap to another strap distance will be 10 inch uh, here if I clear that so it is um, 10 inch uh, plus uh, something just uh, it's not clear here just um, this value will be 529 by 32 529 by 32 okay so um, 10 inch point 529 by 32 and also if you see here and from here uh, from that point to that point its distance is its distance is 144 half that means 144.5 point uh, five. so if I open my from here if I open my calculator so here is our distance our distance is 144.5 and it will be divided by our uh, here if I come here total 25 bar okay total 25 bars so what will be uh, 20 25 bars so uh, the 25 bar means uh, it will be uh, 24 okay After so here I will just um, calculate our total distance sorry it will not be 20 uh, 144 actually this distance is not um, 144.5 okay so it's more uh, less than it so it will be just uh, if we see here it will be uh, 5 in 5 in uh, 29 divided by 32 in okay 5.29 divided by 32 in this is our um, tie spacing so from here you can see that so in this way actually and here is where there have no slab so if I just close that and uh, if I open escape and if I open our slab from here suppose uh, that slab I mean that beam sorry not that one close so just select that one after that right click and here create model detailing so from here 1 is equal to 1 feet after that press ok and now see here here is your reinforcement detailing uh, for that side they have no uh, difference between the strap but here if you see here 
they have history of difference so here uh, our history of distances here 6 okay uh, 6 is 57 by 64 uh, 6 uh, dot 757 by 64 in and number 3 word okay and for here they have a difference and for here they have a difference so they have three layer of reinforcement uh, I mean it's up here actually so uh, and here is the reinforcement uh, number two okay number two top I mean two number four reinforcement and in bottom one four reinforcement okay so here uh, two number four reinforcement eight okay uh, so after that if we come here if we come here just just see that that is the left side uh, I mean here is our left side uh, most really left side beam cross section so here is our slab thickness and uh, it's just like a T beam okay it's designed like a T beam and from here if you see that it's distance from that point to that point 5.5 okay its distance is 5.5 inch and our total height was 18 inch right so if I see here our clear cover of it that one point six eight seven uh, actually this clear cover is not okay our clear cover was one point two five maybe so like that way just you can find out your and here is your uh, tie reinforcement I mean diver actually here so they have also this is a section CC 2b1 if you see one to that uh, 2b1 and its section is here is the section D here is section F 2b1 here is the section C okay here is the uh, for that section C this is a section C and for that section for uh, that section our reinforcement this is a reinforcement for that section okay uh, this uh, section and here is another section so like that way just you can find out your uh, reinforcement detailing from your I'm from and actually here here are uh, how much reinforcement is required to design that beam just you can find out its quantity here just zero point and here also available which types of bar are required and how much okay there is also available here so I think uh, it's clear to you and you know next video I'll show you about slab detailing and also I'll show you about the foundation uh, detailing and foundation design also So if you think that that was helpful for you, then please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also like our video, share our video and leave a comment. So thank you. Thank you very much. Stay connected till next video.